Here's how to interpret an ABG step by step. Starting off with this question, see if you can interpret the findings. So this ABG actually shows a metabolic alkalosis, and here's why. If we start off by looking at the pH, we can see that it's really high. So this points towards an alkalosis. Next, if we look at the oxygen, we can see that it's in the normal range, and so is the CO2. When the CO2 is out of the normal range, this normally points towards a respiratory cause of the imbalance. And because the CO2 is normal, we know it's not going to be a respiratory cause of the alkalosis. Next, if we look at the bicarb, this is really high. And bicarb is normally a cause of a metabolic imbalance, either acidosis or alkalosis. Normally an acidosis when the bicarb is really low, and an alkalosis when the bicarb is really low really high. So because the bicarb is high in this situation, we know it's going to be probably a metabolic alkalosis. To confirm this, we can look at the base excess, which is above the normal range. Base excess just means that there's higher than normal amounts of bicarb. We know that in this picture, there's no respiratory compensation because the CO2 is normal. If there was compensation, the CO2 would be high to try and bring more acid to compensate for the alkalosis. For more videos like this and more OSCE tips, then make sure to follow Geeky Medics.